guys, welcome back to Charlie and me, our camping vlog, a midweek info video. As you know, with the Camping Crew podcasts, we review products from time to time. And a couple of people have got in touch with us over the years and asked would we review different camping products. And today, this isn't really my thing, but there are members of the camping crew who love their coffee. If you love your coffee, seemingly this Carpoint coffee maker is the thing for you. It's 12 volt, it works on a cigarette lighter. It's 170 watts, which I think works out at about four amps maybe. And it's 150 milliliters. Now, basically that is one coffee, but the coffee people tell me that when it's made coffee, not instant coffee, that's a nice shot of coffee. So what we're gonna do is, I've already unboxed it because I wanted to wash out the unit. It comes in this box. As I say, it's got a 12 volt cigarette lighter on the end of it for power. And it comes with a little small 150 mil mug, which has been suggested by Deirdre and some of the crew that we actually just use that as a vessel and pour the coffee when it's made into a cup and then add your milk, your sugar or whatever way you take it. So I will show you this product. We're gonna make a coffee in the camper van and Deirdre's going to taste it and let me know if it's as good as the coffee. So I've made my way over to the kitchen. I have the coffee percolator unboxed. It's, I'll show you, it's just plugged into a 12 volt socket. So you will need a 12 volt cigarette lighter type socket. You need your coffee, you need your mug and you need water. So let's set it up. One thing you won't be needing is that kettle because that's what's going to make your lovely cup of coffee. Now, of course, depending on how strong you like your coffee will depend on how much coffee you put into that in a second but first of all this takes makes 150 milliliters of coffee so there is a 125 mil mark and a max and a min and that gets us just up just short of the maximum amount of water that you need to put into it you get this little vessel with it there's an on off switch here which as you can see it is not on yet you place that in under there, you move that out of the way, and then, depending on how you like your coffee, we reckon that if we just fill, if you don't like it too strong, and I'm making this for Deirdre, she doesn't like it too strong, so I'm gonna go just above that line, kind of halfway between those two lines there. Now remember, whatever your favorite coffee is, we're using blue butterfly coffee. And it looks like it's gonna take maybe just a little short of two and a half spoons. I think that will be enough. Place it in there, then you spin this around, close the lid and power it on. It says it takes six minutes, so I'll come back to you in six minutes. Okay, so that's been going now for a little over five minutes and it starts making a gurgling noise and the water is almost gone. It, actually, it is gone. So I'll just turn it off. Now it says to leave it for a minute or two. I suppose it's just to let any of the last water drain through the coffee. And it says as not to stain the base when you take that cup out. So let's just leave it for a minute or two. Okay, this slides out of the way. Now I'm just going to take this out and put it over here out of the way. Get the cup for Deirdre. And I'm just transferring the coffee into the cup. She likes a little bit of milk with that. And then I get a verdict. They say the proof of the pudding is in the eating. So the proof of the coffee should be in the drinking. And there's not much left in that. <laughs> so yeah, I think it got the okay. So it's 12 volt, plugs in on a cigarette lighter, 170 watts and 150 milliliters of water to heat up. It's car point and it's available from happyturfconversions.ie. If you were a coffee drinker, Charlie, you'd like that, wouldn't you? So we made it in about six to eight minutes. It just makes, one cup of coffee and then depending on how you want strong or weak coffee i think that might have been a little bit too strong for deirdre i went 
kind of three quarters way, but it's up to yourself. And then I suppose it depends on the coffee as well. But they're available again at happyturfconversions.ie. All the contact details come up at the end of the video. I'm Aaron from Charlie and Mia Camping Vlog. Oh, he's so tired after all the work I did. We'll talk to you again very, very soon to review another product on a Wednesday on Charlie and Me, our camping vlog. Take care.